I never have felt like it's any sort of disadvantage. It's just um, another part of me and, and, and it doesn't change anything for me. You know, like each person has things that they, that make them the person they are and experiences that make them the person they are. And, um, and that's part of our journey as humans on this planet, to be honest. So uh, I try and, and use the experiences I've had to, to the best of my ability. I was never really into sport when I was a kid, um, but my dad needed to get rid of my siblings and I for the summer because he had to work. So we literally just drove past Heaton Tennis uh, Lawn Tennis Club, and there was this massive banner on the on the front of the um, of the club just saying like summer camp is nine to five, uh, five days a week. And he literally swerved the car into the parking, walked into reception, asked where he could sign us up, signed us up. And then next thing I knew, I was on a tennis court with some you know, racket in my hand and, and someone hitting a ball at me. I went through some, some personal events that led me to uh, want to commit to the, to the sport even more. And uh, at that point, I decided that moving to Spain was, was going to be best for for my um, for my tennis career and also a great um, a great experience on, on uh, as a kid as well you know it taught me a lot independence and um, and uh, you know learning a new language and a culture. Having had uh, a lot of surgeries, um, you know, from a very young age and and uh, you know spending a lot of time in in, in hospitals and in just in different environment. Um, uh, since I can remember, really, I guess that's uh, that's just built me into you know uh, the person that I am, and, and and maybe it's giving me a little bit more independence. Maybe um, you know it's it's allowed me to see to see the world from a different angle, to to see humans from a different angle. The PSP um, uh, program has been great for me the last few years. The main reason being is that I, I went through a period of, um, of injuries that just seemed to kept, keep having a domino effect. Um, one would lead to the other. I think that the biggest thing for me was the support that I had um, from from the doctor, uh, Joe Larkin, who's pretty incredible, and, and the physios and Millie, who put a lot of work in with me uh, during that period. And, and I think that that um, medical support was uh, was and has been to date the the biggest thing for me for sure. I have a lot that I want to do better and I need to do better to keep pushing myself forward in the game. Um, and that's that's my goal: just keep improving, keep keep pushing myself, uh, keep learning from the people that I have around me. Who you know that they're, they're they're fantastic and and uh, my team. Uh, you know they, they have a lot that they want to teach me as well and uh, and i just want to uh, i just want to be a sponge and soak in whatever i can just don't limit yourself um you know do do whatever you whatever you set out commit yourself to a hundred percent and and give it a go and uh, you you know you can only do your best at something and um you know each person shouldn't you know shouldn't compare themselves to to, to the human next to them they should instead just, um, you know, try and be the best that they can be and, and, and fulfill their potential and that, let that potential take them wherever it's going to take them.